I'm Cindy Williams. I'm the vendor coordinator for the California Peace Officers Association, and we'd like to thank you for joining us and, and hanging out with us to hear about great products and services that our vendor partners are, are offering. It's been a challenging year getting together face to face, so we wanted to pivot to a digital opportunity to connect as everyone is doing this year. But we did want to bring you um, great resources uh, today and, of course, uh, October 14th as well when we do another demo days with more, more service providers. But uh, it is challenging to, to get to connect and we wanted to make sure that we provided that opportunity to our membership as well as to our vendor partners who support us all year long in our, at our events. So we appreciate each and every one of them joining us for demo days as well. Um, uh, with that, I would like to introduce our, our next presenter with National University. This is Kevin Tarazi, and he is an account specialist, and he has lots of great information to share on scholarships and uh, the degree programs that National University is offering. So welcome, Kevin. Thank you, Cindy. Hello, everybody. I am so happy to be here. I appreciate all of your time. And uh, I just want to give a special shout out to Cindy who organized all of this. Everything went smooth. Everything went well. It was my uh, kind of first time doing a virtual conference and um, everything went really well. I'm sure there was a lot of stressful points behind the scenes, but it was never uh, came to our side. So thank you very much for that. Oh, very kind of you. Thanks. So we go ahead and share my screen. With everybody again my name is Kevin Tarazi I am the account specialist with public safety and the main reason I am here today is talk to you about Nash University and the public safety promise so what is the public safety promise it is a 25% tuition scholarship for sworn and non-sworn personnel retired personnel qualify also and this is for undergraduate and graduate degrees this is going from the associate's level all the way to the master's level. So, and one unique about National University is that we allow certificates and non-degree programs to be qualified as well. What do I mean by non-degree seeking programs? So if you're already at a university and you want to take a couple more classes to speed up the process, you're able to come to National University as a non-degree seeking student, take those couple classes and transfer them over to another university. You're able to do that. We do that all the time for many students uh, and the 25% scholarship will still qualify as well. And just to further support all public safety personnel, we want, we're extending this to spouses and dependents. This is a 25% scholarship for them as well. Again, associates all the way to the master's level and no exceptions. This is for certificate and non-degree programs. We have over 75 degree programs. So whatever goal you have, whether it's a career-wise, personal goal, or academic goal, we're here to help you out in any way we can. And we'll find the right program just for you. The best thing uh, I want to offer for everyone here is the Fast Track Scholarship. One, again, National University is very unique compared to other universities because we want to combine as much uh, savings as possible for anyone that's uh, supporting our community day in and day out. The Fast Track Scholarship allows you to take four classes in a six month period and that fourth class is free. Let me say that one more time, that fourth class is free. That's absolutely amazing. Uh, so you're, this will allow you to save up to 50% on a degree program. Uh, this is for any organization that you work with, whether you're a sheriff, police officer, uh, or EMT, it doesn't really matter. But as long as you're taking four classes consecutively, that fourth class is free, and you tie in that 25% scholarship. The most unique thing about National University is our credit for prior learning. So over here, I use the post training as an example. This is, uh, I can go into three different programs. I use uh, the Criminal Justice Administration, Homeland Security Emergency Management, and Public Administration. As you can see, the very first one, uh, BS in Criminal Justice, allows you to use the California Basic Post to transfer in seven courses. That's saving you seven months and saving you thousands of dollars right there. And of course, you can use Homeland Security and Emergency Management 
that's going to be five classes and public administration is five classes. As you can see, the farther away you move from criminal justice, the less credit you will receive, but you'll always receive some form of credit. Um, again, this is saving you time and saving you money. We always want to make education affordable and accessible. So this is how we're tackling both of those problems right away. And just like with a scholarship, you were able to put on two scholarships onto your file to save 50%, you're able to combine the post training with other certificates that you might have. For example, if you have JCOR, BSCC, or FLETC, you can grab those in and then combine them together as well for additional savings. So you can see for the criminal justice program, they'll give you three courses, except for FLETC, they'll give you four classes. Now, if you don't have all of this, that's okay. You know, it all depends on your current uh, employment, what your training is, um, but we're very flexible when it comes to certificates. So just because you don't see your specific certificate here, doesn't mean it doesn't exist. It's just, I didn't have the chance to post it here. So always, whenever you're enrolling, always jump in and submit your certificate training for us. That way we can give you more credit. Tuition cost overview. I want to take a second and break this down real quick because it's, uh, I know money is always a big aspect of education. I just want to make sure uh, I'm giving you all the information necessary to make the best decision about your education. So right here per unit is $370. And again, this is a tuition scholarship, so it's going to affect your tuition per unit. And so the 25% scholarship will drop per unit to 277.50. And National University is on the quarter system, so you're looking at one class to be 4.5 units. With the scholarship, you're looking at one class to be 1248.75. And of course, right underneath it, you have the second line, which is the master's degree. 1491.75, but you can see how much of a drop that is right here compared to the uh, before and after. Because that's already a lot of savings right there. And then you add the fact. <laughs> Uh oh, Kevin, we're having a little bit of sound issues there. Kevin, can you hear us? Sorry, team. We'll see if we can get Kevin back again. Looks like Kevin's trying to recap. Can you hear me now? There we go. How's this? Is this better? It's still, it's coming in and out. How about now? Is this, does this sound a little better? It's a little better, but it's still pretty sketchy there. Okay. I am very sorry about that, everybody. Is it the coming in and out? The presentation or is, is showing great, though. The presentation is showing great, it's just my audio. Correct. Okay. I'll try to talk slower. Does, does this sound better? A little bit, yeah. Okay. So I just turned off the, the Wi Fi on my phone. Hopefully, that makes it a little better. It is a but, bit, it is, yeah. Okay. So if you do have any problems at any point, um, if my audio is breaking out, feel free to put up the chat because I'm gaining everything uh, very quickly from you guys. But I think the Wi-Fi on my end is a little weak. I apologize for that. OK. 
Okay, so I'm going to give it another shot. Like I said before, we do have over 75 degree programs. This ranges from the health field, business, law, as well as the educational field. Here at National University, we're very well known for our, uh, for our teaching credentials, as well as our nursing program. But of course, again, we have over 75 degree programs, so you're not limited to those uh, degrees. Of course, I just showed uh, criminal justice and homeland security. Again, you're not limited to those programs as well. If you like to pursue an MBA, a master's program, uh, marketing, you have the ability to do so as well. So we're not going to pigeonhole you for anything. The two scholarships will be combined together for any degree that you would like. Just a little bit of information about Nash University. We're founded here in San Diego, 1971, by a man named David Chigos. He was a retired uh, Navy uh, commander, and he was the president of human resources at General Dynamics. During 1971, he saw that a lot of his personnel were being deployed or restationed uh, during the Vietnam War. And if they were enrolled at a university, that was a traditional semester based, they could not withdraw because they only had 30 days notice. So that was not a long time at all. That's why he developed National University on this one course every month format. So here at National University, one class is four weeks long, one class every 30 days. So if you have 20 classes to complete your degree, you'll be done in 20 months. The, beauty, the beautiful thing about that is accelerated pace. Everything that we do is on accelerated pace, so you're able to finish quickly, save time, and save money. That's what we're all about. Nonprofit University in California, and we have over 75 degree programs with a local support and global reach. If you choose, uh, you can do international study, so you can go abroad and study. Of course, with COVID, that's being affected, but hopefully things calm down in the coming months, you're able to do that. But of course, that's always your option. The most important thing I want to emphasize about National University is that we are regionally accredited by WASC. That's our regional accreditation, which is West Coast based. It's the same as UCLA, Berkeley, UCSD, any of the universities that is West Coast based will be WASC. I just want to take a moment and talk to you about regional versus national accreditation. Regional accreditation is what you want to be looking for because it is an older and more prestigious university. Majority of nonprofit universities and institutions are regionally accredited. Uh, credits transfer easily. So if you started going to Berkeley, stopped and pursued a, a career, or for whatever reason you stopped and you like to come to national, we can transfer all those courses over and vice versa if you want to go back to Berkeley and you transfer from uh, National University to them. It's very easy. You don't have to worry about doing classes over again. You're only moving forward with your degree. In regards to national accreditation, it's mostly for-profit as vocational and technical programs. Uh, they might accept credit from regional, but majority of the time it's going to be a nationally accredited institution, so it's much harder because they want to make sure they're making money off of you because they're usually for-profit and they're regarded as less rigorous. What it basically means national accreditation is in a tax bracket. So they're not required to have high standards. They're just in a specific tax bracket. So I know you're having a lot of presentations and you have a lot of options for your education. I'm not gonna strong arm you into coming to National University. But I just wanna make sure that you are pursuing the right university for your right academic program and your career. So make sure you're going to a regionally accredited university. Why choose National University to begin with? One, we're year round enrollment. Because each class is four weeks long, one class every four weeks, you're able to start whenever you want. If you'd like to start in October, we can definitely do that. If you want to wait until January, 2021, we're able to do that as well. Everything's on accelerated pace and everything's open enrollment. So we're able to work with you on your schedule. 
faculty that brings real life experience. For me, that's the most important thing because our faculty members are not people who just went to college, got a bachelor's, master's, and then doctorate degree and started teaching. They have worked in the real world. They own their own businesses. They've worked in specific fields for many years and they're able to combine the real world experience with the textbook so you can become a better learner from them. Programs and courses that offer career relevance. We're not giving you most random degrees. Everything, every degree that we have is somehow correlated with your specific profession or some kind of field that you wanna go into. Financial aid and scholarship opportunities. Again, we are WASP accredited. That's our regional accreditation. Because of that, you can use FAFSA, Pell Grant, Cal Grant, whatever form of financial aid and combine it with scholarships. We want you to save money. We don't want you to graduate with $100,000 in debt. We just want you to uh, finish your degree quickly and in an affordable manner. Blackboard mobile app. I want to talk about technology real quick because this is one of my favorite things that we implemented. You can you go on to your classes any way you want. We're losing your, your audio again, Kevin. It was great for a while there. Do we have you at all? Sorry, gang. Sounds like we're still having some connection connectivity issues with Kevin. Can we hear you at all, Kevin? We can't hear you at all. Hey, how about right now? I just switched my Wi-Fi. Does that sound better? That that's a, it's better. Yes. Better. Okay. I'm very sorry, everybody. I really apologize. I don't know what's going on. Um, I tested my Zoom and my internet quality was okay before we started. Um, very sorry about that. Not a, not a worry. Distance learning is impacting everyone. Absolutely. Uh, everyone is testing our flexibility for sure. That's for sure. So does this sound better to everybody? Uh, it's a little challenging, but we can hear you. A little challenging. Press on, hear. yeah. Okay. So what I'm going to do is try to talk a little bit slower. That way you can at least try to understand me. So like I was saying, Blackboard mobile app is a great feature because it allows you to go into your class any time. So you can go on using your laptop, phone, or tablet. It doesn't matter, Mac or PC. You're able to be at the airport, you can be in your squad car, you can be out at a restaurant and you're still keeping in touch with the professor, which I believe is the most important thing. Uh, so you, there's really no way that you can miss assignments. You can always keep track of your uh, grades, um, reach out to your professor during office hours, it makes it very easy. And then of course, student services. Like I said, many times we are WASC accredited. And because of that, it's not only that we offer uh, great programs, but we have to make sure that all of our students uh, graduate successfully. So what we're able to do is provide all these different types of services to make sure that you reach your academic goal. My two favorites are the enrollment and academic advisors. When I was pursuing my bachelor's degree at a traditional semester-based university, I didn't have advisors to help me. As a result, I ended up taking 
random courses that I didn't need for my program. The problem with that is it took it, made me take longer to graduate and spend more money. Whereas we have advisors on your side assigned to your file, that way they can constantly make sure you're on the right track with your education. That way you don't have to worry about uh, taking random courses or finding the next class for your program. They'll definitely there to help you in any way that you can. They're also referred to as the human encyclopedias of the university because they know the entire ins and outs of the universities. They're able to help you in different ways. And one of my favorite things is the online library. We have the largest online library in California. I believe last time I checked in 2019, it was the fifth largest, uh, which is very impressive um, for, for us in California, considering we're in competition with UCLA and Berkeley. So the online library does have tutors, writing a center, as well as the math tutors. You don't have to be in San Diego for that. You can be anywhere in the world. It will most likely be Zoom like this. Hopefully they won't have connectivity issues and be able to hear them, especially if you're getting math help. And then of course, accessibility and wellness, no matter what thing you believe is stopping you from pursuing your degree, we have some form of way to assist you. So whether it's scholarships, credit for prior learning, or you need someone to help you take notes, whatever it may be, there is a service out there and we're ready to assist in any way we can. How to get started. If I motivated somebody here on this call ready to move forward, easiest thing to do is grab your phone and scan the QR code right there in the corner. That will take you to our public safety promise page and it will show you all the information that I just gave you about our scholarships, about different programs, and you can fill in your information to submit to us and then we can reach out to you. We'll have an advisor reach out to you within 24 to 48 hours. But if you're not ready for that, you feel free to give them a call. I have the phone number right here. Call at your convenience and we'll definitely assist you, find the right degree program, make the process seem seamless and will help you move forward with your education. And in regards to enrollment, there are five easy steps. Remember, we're on an accelerated pace. Because of that, uh, we always do everything on a faster pace than other universities. So we have five easy steps for you to enroll. The first one is speak to an advisor. You can speak to me or speak to an enrollment advisor about your transcripts, about programs and scheduling. And then you submit an application to the university. This can be done from our website. Honestly, it takes less than 10 minutes, maybe 10 minutes max. The third thing is submit your official transcripts. We want your official transcripts from other universities and colleges that you've went to because we want to transfer in as many classes as possible. That way we can uh, give you as much credit as possible. That way you're not repeating anything. You're only moving forward with your degree. The fourth step, as providing an employee verification form. By showing that you work at a public safety agency, we're able to put that 25% scholarship to your file right away. That way you don't have to worry about extra documents, about your account balance being incorrect or anything like that. You can just focus on classes. And of course, the very last step is submitting your California basic post. Of course, I use POST as an example. If you have any other type of certificate or additional certificate, please feel free to submit that as well. We'll try to give you credit for that as well. But we need that early on so we can make it official on your evaluation. I'd like to take a pause for a second. Does anybody have questions or concerns about anything? Kevin, I wanted to ask, this is Sean real quick, is, is a lot of agencies are right now, especially those that are in their squad cars and stuff that are, that are beholden to what, whatever systems their agency uses to, to view online, you know, learning and things like that. What kind of, cause I know you mentioned, you know, they can keep track of things through the, um, the Blackboard app, but what kind of, mm -hmm. uh, whether it's the Zoom or WebInx, what, what kind of platforms for live engagement is national using based off what the user might need and they say, oh, my agency can't use Zoom because of the 
security issues, so we only use this? How do they, how do they make sure that they can still can, uh, stay engaged? That's a great question. I'm glad you asked that. Uh, so, of course, uh, National University does use Zoom. Uh, so that's another way of uh, professors getting hold of students, but it's not the main way. It's an additional way. So the main way that professors uh, use their live lecture or one-on-one -on -one meetings with students is via Blackboard. So as long as you're able to access Blackboard, you can uh, access the office as well as kind of the chat room. Uh, the, it's also referred to as meeting room. Okay, thank you. Thank you for that. That was a great question. I appreciate that. Does anybody else have any questions or concerns about anything at all? Well, excellent. Um, I Here's my information right here. Please feel free to pass it on to others in your agencies, in your departments, your friends, your spouses, your dependents, whoever you think is ready to move forward with their education. I put my, my director uh, information as well, Mark Bailey, that's my director. So if you wanna go straight to my boss, uh, you're more than welcome to, he's very nice and he enjoys talking to students. So feel free to reach out and we're again, we're so happy to be here. Cindy, thank you for having us. Uh, we're here to support you in any way we can. So if you want us to talk to your agency directly, let me know. I can do that as well. Uh, but feel free to pass on my information so we can help you reach your academic and personal goals. Awesome. Thank you, Kevin. I also just wanted to share that National University has been a sponsor at our live uh, advance events for the last several years. So we thank you for that sponsorship and that partnership as well. And we know that it's just going to continue because it's, it is a great relationship and we appreciate uh, your entire team and the support that you provide um, CPOA and all of our members. So thank you for that, Kevin. And now I'm going to do a screen share because there is a prize winner that we want to highlight. Ta-da! Congratulations to Eric Swift, who has attended, I think, the majority of our demo days um, presentations today. So thank you, uh, Eric, and congratulations, Napa County Sheriff, National University. We'll make sure they get your information and get that prize out to you. Uh, again, thank you to all of our demo day presenters today, especially National University um, coming in uh, at three o'clock in the afternoon after a full day. So we really appreciate that. But I do want to remind you that we have another demo days coming up uh, October 14th. Let the products come to you. We have a full list of vendors showing uh, University of San Diego, Panasonic, Tyler Technologies, Zephyr Tech, Mark 43, and the Breeze screen uh, will be coming in at two. And I'm sure we'll get some more uh, in the next several days. Uh, please engage with all of our vendors um, on the app. The CPOA events app is a great tool for you to connect with our vendor partners. They're also listed as sponsors, so you can connect with them under either of those icons, the demo days icon or the sponsor icon. We thank them for all of their efforts uh, in joining us today and all the hard work um, that they've done putting these presentations together. And uh, we will see you guys, uh, hopefully, on, on tomorrow's session at 2 o'clock. And then, of course, for demo days on October 14th. So have a great night, everyone. And thanks again for your participation. Thanks, Kevin. Thank you, everybody. Have a great day. Thank you.